Hey, what's up, Diecast fans? Joel Twenty Studios here today, bringing you the Diecast haul on these models I've ordered throughout the weekend. I gotta say that these were a number of great models that I were able to find for a really good price, and some of them that actually came on Monday. Yeah, there were like six models that I got that day, and then over the weekend I only got like three, but they really the number has really increased from then. So yeah, as you can see in this collection, I have. Two Majorettes, one Matchbox, one Kyosho, and six Hot Wheels vehicles. Two of them are new for 2022 for this year, so I'm just going to go ahead and go through each one of them really quick. Just show you what models I have acquired. So, first starting off with this model here, this is the Audi A3 Sportback from Kyosho in silver. I mean, this is a really nice compact car. Really cool. And then these two models I got from Majorette. I got the Man Lions City C in green on the left. And on the right is the Toyota Silica GT Coupe from, also from Majorette, as you can see here. Number 29 is like a racing vehicle. It has rubber tires, the suspension, opening parts, and it's a licensed vehicle. The same also goes for the man bus as well. Yeah, this is it right here. I had a previous um, man from Majorette that I also revealed that's also a bus. Mm -hmm. And then these Hot Wheels models, I got the Nissan Z. Proto, which is one of the new models for this year. Really nice looking. And then the Lotus Sport Elise. And, and man, I like really how it looks in white. And it's very well detailed. And then down here have the the BMW R1200 RT police, RTR police motorcycle. And I thought this was pretty unique myself. You can collect the 2012 Highway Series. But yeah, this was something from 2011. And then here I got the Ain't Fair, which is another bus. And I, I thought this was a pretty unique model to have. So I picked that one up. And then here's one of the other models that are new for this year, the Koenigsegg Gemera. When I saw them unveil this in the Hot Wheels lineup, I really was, was really anxious to try to get my hands on it as quick as possible. But I mean, they, they have this car for cheap prices now on eBay. So anyone who wants to try and find that for a cheap price, I mean, they can go online there, but they can't find it in stores. And then lastly, the Ford Ranger Raptor, the 2019 version. It's part of the Ford Performance. It even has the built for a tough, which I thought was a nice touch on it. Kind of looks like a bit of an advanced version of the Ford F-150 SVT Raptor. Really, really cool. Ford official licensed product and it's part of Ford Performance too. So yeah. So that's my entire um, diecast haul on these models for today. Um, if you guys enjoyed, be sure to like as well as comment and subscribe and tell me what models did you find the most appealing to you. And until then, I'm Joel on 20 Studios and I'll see you again on another diecast haul or another quick review. Until then, so you guys take care and peace.